Hi everyone. How are you? Meet again with Movie Adult Recap. In this video, I will tell the plot of a film called Y2 Mama Tambien, a film released in 2001. This film tells the story of the journey of two teenage boys who try to have sex with a young mother. Before this video starts, don't forget to subscribe so that I can be even more enthusiastic about making videos for all of you. Thank you. The film begins with two teenagers who have been friends since they were kids. The two men are named Julio and Dan Tenek, who come from a rich family. Each of them also already has a girlfriend who always has sex every day. But, because their girlfriends have to continue their studies abroad. Finally, their girlfriend had to leave Julio and Tenek. Since then, Julio and Tenek's life became chaotic, like there was no passion to continue living. A few days later, Julian and Tenek are invited to attend the wedding. And it turned out, that this wedding was a very important event, and only attended by government officials. But, when they were there, Julian and Tenek made a mess. Julian who was very bored with the event. He accidentally spilled coffee on Uncle Tenek's shirt. Finally made Uncle Tenek very angry and embarrassed. After Julian spilled the coffee, they accidentally met a very beautiful woman named Anna. They then could not stand to tease and seduce Anna. They said, if they are great men who can make all women fall in love. Then, Julian then invited Anna to go with him to a beach that was so beautiful. But Anna refused their invitation. Because, it turns out that Anna is the wife of Uncle Tenek. Of course this made them surprised to hear his statement. Finally, their hopes of having sex with Anna were hopeless. Even, though they had planned to make love to Anna on the beach later. At night, Anna gets a call from her beloved husband. Because Anna's husband is out of town on duty. Turns out Anna's husband brought bad news that night. He admits to having an affair to have sex with another woman. After Anna heard the statement from her husband. Anna was very disappointed with her husband. He even cried that night. Anna also thinks that her relationship with her husband is sincere love from the bottom of her heart. But it's wrong. The next day. Suddenly Anna immediately contacted Tenek to ask if he was serious about bringing himself to the beach. Tenek was surprised to hear that. And thought the beautiful young mother was not interested in his invitation. Actually, Anna did it all to relieve the pain and sadness she was experiencing. Finally, Tenek immediately called Julian to immediately make the best possible plan. And it turns out, the beach that Tenek and Julian talked about to Anna, it's all bullshit. Then, Tenek and Julio immediately went to the supermarket to shop for food to be brought to the beach. And also looking for the beach they will go to with young mother. They finally found a beautiful beach located right at the end of an island. Finally all the necessities and equipment are complete. Then, Tenek and Julio went to pick up Anna at her apartment. And this is where their journey begins. While in the car, they start to tell about their life. Starting with Anna telling about her background. It turns out that Anna works as a dentist. While Tenek and Julian are just unemployed. Finally, they look like old friends. And Anna seemed to feel comfortable chatting with them. Although Anna always smiles when she talks to Tenek and Julian. It turns out, she actually still feels sad because her husband cheated on her. At night, the location of the beach which is so far. Finally, they were forced to spend the night in a small village to find food and rest. After they finished dinner, they immediately went to their rooms to rest. But, Tenek had an idea to peek into Anna's room. Tenek wished he could see her sexy body and be able to have sex with her. But, how shocked they were when they saw Anna was crying. Because Tenek couldn't bear to see Anna crying. Tenek cancels his plans. The next day, the trip to the beach continued. Now we can see them if we get closer. But, Tenek and Julian are shocked. When they find out that Anna is a hypersexual young mother. Even, 
Anna started asking Julian and Tenek about their sexual experiences. Anna also said, even though Tenek and Julian are playboys, but they will never be able to give Anna sex like her husband. But Tenek and Julian deny everything. They are very confident. If Tenek and Julian could give Anna more sex than her husband. But when the theme of the conversation is getting more intimate, suddenly their car broke down. And finally, they were forced to return to spend the night in a village. They returned to stay at a small hotel. Well, when Tenek is taking a shower, he shouted at Julian to give him shampoo. But Tenek was surprised when he saw Anna who was crying in her room. But Anna suddenly told Tenek to slowly open his towel. At first Tenek refused Anna's request. But slowly he obeyed what Anna said. And Anna slowly also took off all her clothes. Finally, Tenek and Anna have sex that day very passionately. But all Tenek's words, if she could give him more sex than her husband, it's just bullshit. Anna looks very disappointed because Tenek's way of having sex is still quite amateur, not yet professional. Suddenly, Julian who was walking past the front of Tenek's room accidentally saw them having sex. After the incident, the friendship between Julian and Tenek is broken. Julian seems to be holding a grudge against Tenek because Tenek had sex with Anna. The plan is to have sex with Anna together. Julian was furious. So he finally told Tenek the truth. If he ever had sex with Tenek's girlfriend before he left to continue his schooling. Hearing that, Tenek got angry and left Julian. The next day, finally their journey continues. And apparently, the friendly relationship between Tenek and Julian was also not good. Then, Anna suddenly told Tenek to stop the car. It turned out that Anna felt guilty for them because he had sex with Tenek. Finally, their friendship was ruined because of a young mother. Then, Anna told Tenek to get out of the car so that Anna could have sex with Julian in the car and hope that there will be no more grudges between them because their desire to have sex with Anna has come true. After they finished having sex in the car, Tenek seemed jealous because Anna had sex with Julian. Then, Anna tries to apologize to Tenek. But, Anna's efforts were in vain. When the journey continues, we can feel the atmosphere in the car that is not conducive. Like there was a grudge between Julian and Tenek. And it turned out to be true. Not long ago, there was an argument between them. When Tenek and Julian fight, Anna tried to separate them. But apparently Anna's efforts were ignored by Tenek and Julian. Even Julian scolded Anna and pushed her away. Finally, Anna became angry with their treatment and chose to leave them. But the consequences of their actions finally brought Tenek and Julian to their senses if their fighting wasn't important. Because friendship is more important than having sex. Tenek and Julian finally forgive each other. They immediately chased after Anna and apologized to her. And finally Anna willing to forgive them. Finally they continued their journey to the beach. A few hours later, they finally arrived at the beach. The cool and beautiful beach atmosphere makes them forget all the problems that are happening. They immediately ran on that beautiful beach. And Anna has promised not to wear clothes or be naked while on the beach. But Suddenly someone came by boat to the beach. Finally, they know each other and play on the beach together. Time passed quickly. And when it was evening, they returned to their tents. But their tents were already filled with pig dung. This makes them have to find a place to stay around the beach. At night, they seem to really enjoy the night drinking alcohol on the beach. Then, Anna invites Tenek and Julian to dance with her because they're a little drunk. Finally, the night ended with having sex together. But it turns out that making love to Anna is the last for them. Because since then, 
Tenek and Julian are very busy with their own lives. Until finally, they did not see Anna again for a year. One year later, Tenek and Julian are in a cafe. Julian suddenly asks Tenek how is Anna. Then Tenek answered, if Anna had died of cancer. After a long conversation, Julian and Tenek finally separated again because they have their own lives. And this film ends with a sad ending. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.